this video, I'm going to show you one of the most effective 2x2 two two concepts out of Trips Tight In in Madden 22. Now, if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. I upload new videos every single day that can help you get better at this game. The other thing that I wanted to let you know is that we just released a Trips Tight In offensive ebook. So if you want to get access to my entire Trips Tight In guide, I would encourage you to go ahead and pick that up. There's a link in the description of this video. It's on sale for just $15. And let's jump in. So we are talking about one of my favorite, favorite plays in this playbook, and that is the doubles in sale. Now, the, the real reason why I like this so much is because it is a very, very powerful corner route that allows you to flood the trip side. Most people, when they defend trip side in, they like to guard the tight end side more heavy because of the PA counter ghost and the big crossing routes that exist at a trip side end. So that being said, let's jump into uh, today's video. The setup is actually really, really simple, and you can do a lot of the setup while you're motioning the receiver over. So what we're going to do is we are going to go ahead and we are going to take our uh, tight end and we're going to put him on a drag. We're going to motion over the outside receiver and we're going to put him on a curl and then we're going to streak the slot. Okay, as you can see right here, this is basically the read. Now, this tight end drag is really, 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 really good, um, especially if they are playing uh, pinch two. A lot of people in Madden at this point, they really like this defense pinch two. So I'm going to show this against pinch two. Um, the beauty of trips tight end is it actually pretty much picks up the defense re regardless. But as you can see here, this tight end drag will get you consistently 10 to 15 yards. It's very, very good against plays like pinch two or cover two sink because the soft squat will oftentimes go upfield with that deep defender. Now, when I snap this curl, I want to put the curl on the number. So just to the outside of the numbers, just like that. If they're running main coverage, if they're running main coverage, um, I am very much so inclined to take the running back and put him on an out route. Um, but I do like that double or that table route as kind of a pressure release against the zone. So I'm going to keep that there. But if they're running man, just throw your curl. Just throw your curl. Um, it's the most consistent play against man. This is not something that I would recommend calling a lot if your opponent is notorious for running a lot of man. Okay, because the corner route in this year's game is not as open as it's been in years past. It is does get open a lot, but it just doesn't get as open as it has in years past. Now against zone though, this thing is a laser. As you can see right there, absolute laser against zone coverage. It doesn't matter if it's cover four, it doesn't matter if it's cover three, it doesn't matter. I mean, the only thing is if they play 30 yard cloud flats, which is which is going to put them in a very bad position uh, for the rest of our uh, the rest of our offense. This is a 35 yard corner, so it's going to be bang bang, especially against like a Tampa two with a 30 yard cloud. But um, anything else, this is going to be wide open. Obviously, if they're playing a 30 yard cloud flat, then what you're going to be able to do is you're going to be able to come back over here and you're going to be able to hit your check down to Mike Evans. Now the other thing I wanted to show real quick is match. You're going to see this absolutely tor torches the match defense uh, to the outside. Very easy, uh, really, really, really good separation. Again, I really recommend that you find a slot receiver that has some type of route running ability for this. Now, again, I talked about the 30 yard. So if they go 30 and 5, what you're going to see is this curl is going to get wide open over on this side. So that's why we put the curl there because they're going to have to go with the tight end. They're going to have to go... Um, you know, they're going to have to go guard some of this stuff. And so the beauty of the curl is it's the ultimate check down, uh, you know, because you're going to see here, they're not going to guard it. They're going to go to the flat almost every single time, whether they are in cover three, cover four, it, it really doesn't matter. Uh, I'm going to shift over here for just a second and talk a little bit about the cover three. So what you're going to see here is if it's cover three, uh, again, this is why I like to get this guy to the outside of the numbers. You're going to see that's a curl flat. But because we snapped him on the numbers, that curl flat gets pulled out by that table route. And that is one of the main reasons why I absolutely love this formation. Now, we, saw, we said uh, if they run man coverage, it's not the best play. But I do want to quickly highlight this tight end drag. Now, cover one Robert's going to do a pretty good job. Um, you see here, like, this guy, you see what I'm talking about? Like, even though he has Slotomatic, route tech's what I recommend. And I run route tech on my guys with deep out elite. But even if even if you 
again, even if you beat the animation, occasionally they'll catch up, especially if they press coverage. So that's just something you need to be aware of. Now, um, the tight end drag is kind of meant to be, you know, the, the counter to that. So if we get man, we'll just check it down to either the drag or the curl. Um, most of the time, most of the time, they're not going to cover the curl. Almost every time what they're going to cover is they're going to cover the drag to the corner. So, you know, you can almost always check down right there. And it's just an easy, easy read. So this is truly, uh, it's probably, I don't call it, honestly, I don't call this as much as I should. This play is really, 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 really good. It really is. Because most people, when they defend trips tight end, they only focus on defending that opposite side of the trips because they're waiting for a crosser, they're waiting for a deep post, they're waiting for something, right? You run something like this, and now they gotta worry about just kind of a basic flooding concept to the trip side that is also going to completely obliterate the pinch two meta, because not only is your corner route gonna be open, which it will be open, your corner route will be open, but also if we watch this, you're gonna see here that my corner route's open, and on that play, my drag is open as well. So. That is the doubles in sale, uh, what I like to do with that. It's a really, really, really good play, especially when you motion it over like that. I think it makes it uh, really good because a lot of times when you run that motion over, they're waiting for you to run something like um, X-Spot or something like that where you do it like this, and now, oh, they've got to cover this, and, and you just put their user in a very bad position. So thanks for watching the video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you want to learn my entire trip site in ebook, I would encourage you to pick it up. There's a link in the description. And real quick before you go, I just wanted to remind you that if you join my Patreon for just $10 a month, you get unlimited access to everything. You get access to every exclusive tip, every offensive ebook, and every defensive ebook that I'll be releasing while your subscription is active. Right now, today, we have 10 ebooks over at the website 10 guides, 10 ebooks for you to be able to absolutely just start dominating in weekend league and start competing in some of these high level Madden tournaments. So if you want to learn all of that material, sign up for the Patreon. There's a link in the description below. And like I said, it's just 10 bucks and you can cancel it whenever you want to. Thanks for watching and we'll see you guys later.